on Earl's Peak, which is a mountain peak in the middle of Iceland, really in the middle of nowhere. Glaciers on one side, black sand desert on the other. It was one of those experiences that you dream about as a director, about going to places that most people have never seen and getting to capture it all in camera. Today is day 71 here in lovely Iceland. We are sort of out of the beaten track. We had to bring all our gear up here. Today we had seven buckets loaded up by our professional mountaineers, and then those were flung beneath an A-Star helicopter, and then we drop it here depending on where we need it. Basically all the people have to be flown in. We got helipads down here. Bring everybody up in the Coast Guard helicopter. The Icelandic Coast Guards helped us out a lot today, so we're happy for that. That took a lot of planning. We had 50 people up there with hair and makeup, wardrobe, props, camera grips, two techno cranes. Safety-wise, it's a tricky place to shoot. You gotta get safety gear. People need to have helmets on because it's easy to slip here and also quite steep. So we had to put up handrails, anchors, safety lines. If you need to go outside of the rope area for work purposes, you have to be harnessed. No one has shot here before, and we have actually never brought crew of this size and all that equipment up on a location like that. So far, so good. The trick will be getting the shot Joe wants and then getting home. Oh, here we go. This is awesome. Yeah. Earl's Peak, beautiful. I loved Earl's Peak. That's what I need. What do we need to do? Incredible. Because we were so well prepared, as soon as he landed, we were able to shoot very quickly. Can I walk? Yes, sir. You're, yep. you're good to go. We are rolling, please. Rolling. Let's the only kill sticks. We're uh, shooting Tom on the top of a 2,000 foot precipice. And action. Is just incredible. I mean, you've got Tom Cruise on the very edge of that peak with the most beautiful light. It was just one of those days I'll never forget. It was amazing, you know, just to sit there and you get to see so much of the country. We're gonna do a little rappelling at lunch, guys. <laughs> you will not find too many actors out there who will go the distance like he does. He's the most committed actor I've ever worked with. And cut. Good. It was to his chagrin that we ended so quickly, and he decided that he'd like to stay a little longer on his own. So we got all the equipment off, he stayed up there and enjoyed the view for a while. It was really peaceful, it was so beautiful. And I think, you know, when you see the film, it captured it. It captured that haunting beauty and kind of serenity.